We want to keep our A1C generally less than seven, but we have very specific metrics too for what is uh, adequate control or ideal control for people with type one diabetes. And in general, we want your time and range, your time between 70 and 180 to be above 70%. And then we want to minimize the time that you're spending hypoglycemic. Now I say this because a lot of times people will know this, but I have patients that come in and they'll say, yeah, my time and range is 75%, it's 80%, but I just, you know, I, I need, to do, need to do better. And it's kind of like, well, why? You know, I think there is this <laughs> yeah, pursuit yeah. of perfection sometimes. And we didn't pull these numbers out of our butt as endocrinologists. We know that if you keep your A1C less than seven, you keep your time and range above 70%, you're gonna live a very long, very healthy life. And, you know, so know those goals and it'll come to kind of what to do about that afterwards. But I think this is an important step. Yeah, the only thing I'll add to that, Jeremy, is when you think about it, every percent represents 15 minutes. And I've learned this from you. 70% really equates to an A1C of seven, and that's a great goal, but it allows us to be out of range seven and a half hours a day. Mm -hmm. and, and think that sort of relates to your first tip, is that even the experts that put up these high goals realize you cannot be in range 100% of the time.